get a drama as a toy for Christmas. He was one of the greatest innovators. What's up specials and welcome to another vlog! Yeah, this is vlog number 11! I did not plan anything for this vlog actually. Medyo pabigla lang ito because this is a very special vlog of mine. The last Quarant Talks episode which was supposed to be released last June 10. Meron kasi doon portion actually na nakalagay. Hashtag Jude get a camera and then hashtag Judith Balong baka naman. So, what we're gonna do today is let's make it real. <laughs> what do you mean by real, Jude? If in just in case di nyo pa nakita yung story ko sa Instagram, it's here! <laughs> and dito na yung bagong camera na binili po natin. So we would like to thank Judith and Balong Panagiton and also um, Camera House. We went to Camera House yesterday and we finally bought a camera so we're gonna do an unboxing video together so here it is what's in the hindi pala siya unboxing un cellophaning so we have here first the camera bag so this is not the sony talaga na camera bag because they did not have anything available so this one is air my Air my. So basically since the camera that we bought was a mirrorless camera so yung viewfinder niya is electronic and not optical it's gonna, not gonna be a very big camera. Medyo maliit lang siya so kasha lang siya dito. And since yung lens na binili natin was kit lens so yun hindi siya masyado yung lens talaga ng pang professional something something whatever. It's just 16 to 50 millimeters na lens ang kit lens niya. So here it is. So here's the bag. So next we have is the beloved camera. Sony A6400. So this is one of the mirrorless cameras na ni released ni Sony last year. So if I'm not mistaken, this one was released last February. This camera is a mirrorless camera. So ayun, by mirrorless, we don't have a mirror that reflects the image. Galing sa lens or galing sa, you know, yeah. Papunta dun sa optical viewfinder. The viewfinder of this camera is an electronic viewfinder. So, so here it is. We have the Sony A6400. This one is the second of their Alpha series that they released last year. The third one was the A6600, which was released between mga April 2019, nata, yun, if I'm not mistaken. So this one is actually a very good camera for videographers. From what I've seen sa mga YouTubers on YouTube, you know, when I was searching talaga, il ilang, ilang days ako consecutive, Andrew, nagasigi panood sa phone ng about cameras. Too many to count. You see that? It's too many to count. Na sobrang grabe po talaga yung pag-study ko kung anong camera yung mabibili ko. Not only for vlogging, you know, for for school or for other for other uses. I spent mga ilang days consecutively watching mga reviews sa YouTube and whatnot. And somehow, generally, what I've concluded is that Canon is good for photography and Sony is good for videography. Although hindi naman sila masyado yung lamang na lamang talaga na like Canon is here sa photography and Sony is here sa photography. Medyo balance na. Meron na talagang ibang mga situations where Canon will be higher or greater and most of the time, yeah, Canon will produce higher quality pictures. Ayan, let's, I think it's, we're ready to open this up. So, ay, no, natanggal na pala yung ano. <laughs> Natanggal na pala yung seal. Yeah, because we checked this sa store. Siyempre naman, you need to double check if complete yung gamit here. So, yeah. Let's start to open it. 
So when we open it, we see a lot of paperwork, you know, yung mga for the Sony 64, A6400, dami ng mga papeles dito, mga instructions, warranties, and what not. Ayun, madami talagang languages, you see. And we don't, we won't read it because I, I'm going to read it later. So next we have the separator, ayun, mga other additional information and instructions. And when we get inside the box, ayun na po, na open na po natin. So we're going to look inside the box right now. So when we look inside the box, we get... Asa ah, camera? Andrew, where's the camera? <laughs> I'm just kidding guys. So what I'm using right now as a camera is the Sony a6400 So but just right now I just really wanted to use the Sony a6400 Kasi syempre naman, bisan na po natin yan. This is a new camera so you know we need to We need to bless it So when you get the box out of the box inside the box what the box so inside the box yeah you'll get the battery one 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 piece of battery and then you know the charger typical charger and then um the strap of the camera since you know it's syempre, it's not that heavy though if I, I mean the camera is not that heavy it's mirrorless it's not dslr so the body is not that big and that heavy it's very portable it still has the same characteristics talaga sa mga dslr na and um it, the lens can be removed it's interchangeable so sony a6400 is using e-mount lens i'm not going to go into the details kasi hindi ito siya camera review okay so i'm gonna show you guys what the camera looks like so yeah that's what the camera looks like right now it has a uh, tilt up screen so you can see or you can check your position and yeah this is the lens of the camera and then we have here yeah hindi na siya in depth so basically unboxing plus blessing bis na po natin ng camera na to if you are um, aspiring videographers who want to start with something small, although there are so, there are already many digital compact cameras, yung mga maliit, yung mga point and shoot, like this one. This is a this is a point and shoot camera. This is Samsung WB35F. There there are a lot of digital cameras that are also great if you're an aspiring photo photographer or videographer. But the reason why I chose mirrorless cameras because this would this is a very good investment especially um if you plan on really having this camera for a very long time so you can you know add improvements like changing the lens or buying hot shoes para you can you know put mga modules or like mi microphones flash camera lights you know so as a photographer slash videographer noob sony a6400 is a great buy already even even now until 2020. so Ayun. So that ends our unboxing, un uncellophaning video this afternoon. So guys, I would like once again, I would like to thank you for your continuous support that you are showing to this channel. Bago natin kakalimutan na no, we are going to read the shoutouts. Kasi naman po, parang medyo matagal na po ako ever since nag shoutout ako. So... Ayun, may shoutouts tayo dito simula. Simula sa pinakamataas na katawan, everybody. Na. So, shoutout po tayo kay Samantha Galagaran Cousin. Sa shoutout, shoutout din tayo kay Matt Espanyola. And shoutout din sa kay Ken Galagaran. And also, shoutout din sa aking shoutout. Hindi po natin tatanggalin yung 1k na goal po natin this before Ju before July. So don't forget to continue to share guys the page, the channel to your friends, to your peoples out there. So um I'm still slowly adjusting to my timetable. Don't worry guys, I will really I will be constant. Diko diko pa so sobrahin ng 1 month yung pag ko sa pag-post ng vlogs. So let's continue to go 
with me on this journey guys especially right now MGCQ pa rin po tayo but a little a little less strict so hopefully soon when we're allowed to go out and travel locally safely maso showcase natin yung mga iba't ibang lugar dito sa Mindanao not only here in General Santos City but also in all of the provinces and the places near General Santos City yung saan yung mapupuntahan lang natin muna as of the moment so, don't worry guys. Thank you so much for your support. Stay safe, stay sane, and stay special. Goodbye guys. And oh no, nag-record na naman tayo na wala si Conrad. Oh, ayan. And then... So, thank you guys. So, please continue to support. Support, support, support.